So as we know that uh, till now we have studied uh, many many pulley questions uh, only related to the fixed pulley. So everywhere if you notice that uh, pulley is there. So there is a pulley which is a uh, fixed pulley and uh, it will be carry lifting the load from like uh, we can say one side one weight is attached and another side uh, another weight is attached. So according to that mass we can say either acceleration is acting uh, Suppose if this mass is 3 kg, this mass is 1 kg, we will say this acceleration is acting downward direction and for this one acceleration is acting what direction everybody? Upward direction. And as it is both are same string, then what is the tension in this string? This string also tension T and this thing also tension T. Am I right or wrong everybody? Okay. All of you? Yes please. Then we know that the weight of the body is acting downward direction 3z and here also weight of the body is acting 1z. Then if I write the equation, so firstly tell me what will happen, it is acting downward, so this is positive and this is negative. So acceleration is acting for here, this is positive and the, this is negative. So what are the equations everybody? We have done 3z minus t which is equals to, that is what? F net is equals to ma, Newton second law, am I right or wrong everybody? Firstly, F net is equals to ma, so F net is equals to 3z minus t which is equals to 3 into a, 3a. Same way for this body, tell me everybody. One is upward force tension and downward force is G. So that what will happen? This is positive and this is negative. So what will happen? T minus G is equals to 1 into A, 1A. One A. So if I add this both the equations, TT will get cancelled. 3G minus G which is 2G. 2G is equals to 4A and G is equals to, you can see 2 1s are 2 2s are. So a is equal to how much everybody? We have got the answer. A is equal to? Yesterday we have solved. A is equal to how much? G by 2. Am I right or wrong? So G like point. many questions uh, I have taught you only about uh, fixed pulleys. So now we are going to study mobile pulleys also. Along with the fixed pulley, you will be getting mobile pulley. So very, very important and uh, very like uh, imagination is also very important. Okay. So let us see that. I think you are all familiar with the solving the questions in the fixed pulleys. Now I am going to introduce a mobile pulley. So I will make with the different colors also for better understanding. So observe very carefully. There is a, this is a rigid surface and having a here one mobile pulley. What is this pulley everybody? This is the what pulley? All of you. Mobile pulley. Mobile pulley. This is a mobile pulley and Next, the thread is the thread is coming like this and it is going like this and there is a pulley which is actually a fixed pulley. What is the pulley everybody? It is a what pulley? Fixed pulley. Understanding? And the weight which is attached to this one is 2 kg. How many kg? All of you? 2 kg. Clear? 2 kg. Understand? Mr. Rudreswa? No. So if you notice it here, we are having a two pulleys here. So this pulley we used to call as, what pulley we used to say? It is the mobile pulley. And this is the pulley, pulley. pulley. What pulley it is? It is the? Fixed pulley. Okay. So observe very carefully now. So as we all earned here for this pulley, the weight is attached is uh, 1 kg. How much weight is attached? All of you? 1 kg. Clear, Amma? Understand, uh, all of you? Now. So, yes, sir. Yes, sir. as we all know that this is the common string, the string which is attached, the same string, so that it is having a same strength or different string. If you notice it, this is the same string. So, it is having a same string or different string. Everybody, same strength or different strength. Firstly, it is having a same strength. Tension T and here also tension T, tension is same and here also away from that, here also tension T. Now, if you notice it, what about this thing? What is the tension in this string? I want to know it. Anybody can tell me how, much, how to find it? So, if you notice it, this is a fixed pulley or mobile pulley, everybody. It is the mobile pulley. Understand, Mr. Dreswa? Everyone? You, unless you speak, you cannot. Okay? Now, observe very carefully. Suppose this pulley is, imagine that the pulley is reached here. The pulley is reached here. So now you tell me, before if you have taken a fixed pulley, a single fixed pulley, suppose if this side the weight is going up, 
and if the, this side the weight is coming down so we can say that if it is a more mass so acceleration is downwards and here acceleration is upwards this is what about the fixed pulley which we studied but if you notice it here mobile pulley if the pulley will suppose go up or the pulley will suppose to come down imagine just now only one string is going or both the strings this and this both it is displacing that is what is my question anybody only one string is displacing or both the strings. Suppose this pulley is came here. This side also it is moving and this side also it is moving. Am I right or wrong? Everybody? Please respond. All of you? Yes, sir. Are you there anybody in meeting? Otherwise, can I stop the meeting? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. So now, yes, sir. here also, yes, sir. Here also uh, tension is acting and here also tension is acting. So that what is the tension in this string? Everybody? Two tensions are acting in this. So that what is the tension here? The tension in this point is how much it is? This is one tension and this is one tension. So here, what is the tension? All of you? Two T. Okay. So two times of tension. Now, for example, so observe very carefully, all of you. For example, this body will start moving. This body will start moving X meters downwards. This body started moving how many meters? All of you? x meters downwards so now can you tell me here how much the body will move up the change in the length the change in the length will be in how much anybody can tell see it is not a fixed pulley so that only the thread will go up so try that is what i said try to imagine very carefully if suppose i will i will imagine this body the the mobile pulley moves x meter upwards for example you can say remember that let me consider now this is the pulley of the position, initial position of the pulley. Let me consider up or down. Let me consider now this pulley came x meters down. x meters down. From this point to this point, how many meters it came? Everybody? x meters down. Means in the sense of, can you tell me the 2 kg body is traveled how many meters up? Because double tension is acting. Yes. So how many meters it will travel? Anybody? Yes, Budreswa? This pulley is traveled x meter downwards means in the sense of this 2 kg body will go how many meters up? That is what I am asking. Okay. So observe very carefully. Now this is the mobile pulley. If the pulley is actually the pulley position is like this. Now imagine this is the if this is attached to this. So now if the pulley will start goes up, suppose if the pulley will go up, then the thread which is present here, that is also will added to this body and the thread which is present here, that is also will added to the body. Am I right or wrong, everybody? Do you all understand what I am saying? Yes, sir. Yeah. So that if this, suppose this body will move some x meters upward direction, x meters it has been moved. So x meters in the sense of this side also some length and this side also some length. So that this 2 kg body will go down how many meters? It will go how many meters? 2x meters. Understand, Amma? This side also it will go down and this side also it will be goes down. Do you understand all of you? Please respond, Ra. Yes, sir. Yes. Now, for example, yes, if this body will go 2x meters up means, 2x meters up means, then here, how much how much distance the this pulley mobile pulley will come down? Anybody can tell. If it will go two x meters up, then here mobile pulley will come how many meters? It will come x meters. Do you understand everyone? Because the two x length it will go upward. Then x length this side it will be shared, and x length this side will be shared. So the totally it will move how many meters down? Everybody. It will move. X meter. X meter. Understand Udreswa? Now, for example, let me consider yes, the velocity. For example, if this body, this pulley will go upward direction with velocity V, then can you tell me with what velocity this body will come down? All of you. If this, this body will go X yes. velocity upward direction, then this body will come down with how many how many direction, how many velocities? Two times of velocity. Mm -hmm. Am I right or wrong? Do you understand? If this body will go acceleration upward direction, 
a times then this body will come acceleration in how many times everybody yes please two a times understand amma because it is a mobile pulley when the body will goes upward this side the length of the string and this side the length of the string both will be added to this so that the the body will goes 2x distance do you understand everyone all of you yes sir for example let me take one more thing for example the thread which is covered the string which is covered here from here to here 1 meter and here to here also 1 meter now the my body is my pulley is lifted to from this position to this position and here there is another pulley which is a fixed one so that the length of the body initially it is at some height now when this position is shifted from here to here the pulley how many meters the string is adding to this one 1 meter plus 1 meter so that the body will travel in how many meters all of you 2 meters okay. yes or no do you understand all of you please respond yes sir clear that is what same way for example this body will move x meter downwards this body moves x meter downwards x meters downwards means this side 1 meter is increasing and this side 1 meter is increasing so means this body travel how many meters up it will travel 2 meter. meters that is what 2x meters understand for example x meters downwards means here x meters and here x meters both the sides that is what the pulley so here how many meters it will go up it will goes 2x meters sir prema understood or not please respond ra yes sir yes sir. that is what so a mobile pulley if you have notice it some x distance this side and from x distance this side totally it will be added to the the pull the body which is hanging so that it will travel how many x plus x which is equals how much 2x distance x. clear so that is what imagination so maybe the mobile the mobile pulley go upward or maybe the mobile pulley will come downwards if mobile pulley moves x meters upwards means here the body will travel with how many meters 2x meters downwards if the body will travel x meter downwards this mobile pulley then here the body will travel upward how many meters everybody 2x meters that is what you should understand mm -hmm. do you understand am i everybody all of you yes Yes, yes sir. so that is what you have to understand if this body will goes upward v velocity then this body will travel downwards 2v velocity if this body will goes upward with acceleration a then this body will travel with a two times of acceleration in downward direction do you all understand or not please respond clear yes, so that is the concept which is present in this so this is very very important if you understand this then only we can proceed and we can solve the numericals So, if anybody having any doubt in this, you can ask me. So, again, I'm saying, if this body mobile pulley, so two x distance, you can consider. If it will move x meters upwards or x meters downwards, then this body mass will changes two times. Do you understand, everybody? The the distance or velocity or acceleration, everything will change how many times? All of you, two times it will change. Okay, ma? That is what you have to remember it. Now. the same question let us find the acceleration what is the acceleration of the body and what is the acceleration of this body okay so observe very carefully so there is a rigid surface 1 okay this is what pulley now anybody can guess i am drawing here mobile mobile pulley okay so for your purpose only we are i am making this much you have to understand it so this is a mobile pulley now the mobile pulley goes up and there is a pulley here what is the pulley this pulley we can say everybody there fixed is a pulley which we is to called as what fixed pulley fixed pulley fixed pulley one question if you understand guys then that's all so there is a body so which is actually attached 2 kg and here is the body which is attached how many kg all of you 1 kg clear understand all of you yes sir yes sir now if you observe they are asking what is the acceleration so let me consider the body moves in upward direction as we know this pulley moves upward direction imagine the body is moving upward direction so acceleration is a above then this body is moving what will happen acceleration downwards or upwards this body is acceleration downward downward okay. now as we know this string this string this string both are same so here what is the tension t here also what is the tension t and here also what is the tension everybody t but here this is a different string and it is acting two strings are acting for the single string so that here what is the tension everybody 
What is the tension? This tension. This tension. What is the tension, everyone? It is the. Yeah, that is what. Now they are asking us acceleration. So let us see that. We all know the, for this one, weight is acting downwards. So weight is equals to one into g, one g. And for this one, weight is acting downwards. W is equals to how much? Ra? Two into g, which is equals to you should tell me two g. Okay, guys, understand? Yes, sir. Narayan, what are you saying, Narayan? I'm not getting. Can you speak? Sir, why, sir, we have written 2T in uh, M. Okay. Here, listen, Narayan. This body, this string is, this is a mobile pulley. And this string is, is a different string. It's not the same string. So, this string is experiencing by the two tensions. This is, this is one tension. This is one tension. That is why the tension in this string is two times of that individual. This tension plus this tension. That is what it will be. Clear, Narayan? Okay, sir. Yeah. That is what you should remember. Now, so let us take FBD. So free body diagram. Free body diagram of first body. So what is the first body? 1 kg. 1 kg body. So let me take 1 kg. Draw the free body diagram. What will happen? 1 force is acting upward. How much it is? 2T. Yes or no? And another force is acting. Which is acting? Downward direction. That is 1G. Clear? All of you? Yes, please. Yes, sir. Yeah. So acceleration is upward direction. So this is positive and this is what? Negative. So form the equation firstly. Form the equation. 2T minus, 2T minus T. 2T minus T minus G. Sorry. Sir. 2T minus G, which is equals to A. Am I right, Rudreswa? Yes, yes, sir. Number one. Now, apply the, uh, apply the free body diagram for second body. Everybody. You all should involve in the, and you should tell me, I am not. How many things we have drawn till now? This is a second body, 2 kg body. So the tension which is two acting. 2 G minus T, sir. Yeah, upward and another one which is acting downwards. So that's all. So what will happen? Two. Acceleration is downward. So this is positive and this is negative. So 2 G minus T, which is equals to what? Yeah. All of you. M A F net is equals to F net is equals to M into A. Everybody, boys, open your mouth, guys. Two A. So this is equation number two. Okay. So just add the equations, both equations. Okay. So what is the both equations, everyone? All of you. What are the both equations? One is two G minus T is equals to two A. Second equation is what? All of you. Two T minus G is equals to A. So, have you noticed it? TT will never get cancelled. Am I right or wrong, everybody? So that I will do this whole equation, I will multiply with what? You, you all people know, whole equation multiply with what? Two. 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 The entire equations will change us into 4G minus 2T, which is equals to 4A. Second equation, 2T minus G, which is equals to A. So, 2T, 2T two. will get cancelled. 4G minus G, which is 3G, which is equals to 4 plus A, 5A. So from that, G is equals to what? Everybody. Sorry, here I have done mistake. Have I done any mistakes? No, I think. Am I correct? Everything is correct? Huh? No, sir. Correct. Yeah, correct only. Very good. So 5T. Then A is equals to, what is the answer? 3 by 5. 3 by 5G. 3 by 5G. So that is the acceleration. Do you understand everyone? All yes, of you? Sir. Yes? Yes, sir. Yeah. Now, as we know, now here you have to be very careful. If you observe very carefully. So, I somewhere I have done mistake. Yeah. Here we have done mistake. Have you checked it? You have not told me. As I told you, if this body's acceleration is A means, then what about this body acceleration? A or 2A? Sir, 2A. 2A. See, that is what I am not, I am making error. So, but you are not saying. So, here what will happen? 2 into A means again 2A. A means again 2A. So that it will become what? 2G minus T is equals to how much it is? 4A. 4A. That is the equation number 2. So here how much it will come? You should speak. A. Come here 4A. So that 4 into 2, how much it will come? All of you. 8. 9A. Okay, 8A. 8A plus 1A, 9A it is. So what is the answer? 3 by? 3 by? I love you. Nine. Three by nine. Three by nine G. Okay. So this is what about it. So now. So what will happen? Acceleration here. Three by nine means. 
we can cancel. Three ones are three threes are. So yeah, A is equal to how much everybody? G by three. equals to firstly G by three. Okay. Now which is positive? As it is going up, we all know above surface. So that it is positive or negative up? Above. So it is positive. So A is equals to G by three. But here, what is the A is equals to? A is equals to not A, 2A it is. So 2 into A, A value how much? Everybody, G by 3. And it is a downward. So that acceleration negative or positive? Or? Sorry, acceleration is negative or positive? Or? Negative. Or negative. Okay. So what is the acceleration of this body? Minus, minus 2G by 3. Clear everybody? Understand or not? All of you? Yes. Please respond. That is what. See, yeah. everything, everything you keep it in mind. If this body will go with the velocity V upward, this body will come 2V velocity down. If the body acceleration is A, this body acceleration is 2A. If the body moves X meters upward, this body will come X meter, 2X meters downwards. Elame Purima, all of you. Yes? Yes, yes sir. sir. That is what. So please keep it in mind. Okay. Next, reverse also. If this body will travel downwards, this is going upward. Suppose this body travel with a 2A, then here what is the acceleration of this body? Going upward. If this body goes acceleration 2A, because both the sides, then here what is the acceleration? Upward direction, A. If this body travel with a 2V velocity downwards, then here what is the acceleration? All of you. V. v. If this body travel with a 2X displacement, both the sides, then here what is the displacement? Everybody. Yes, please. Upward. X. Clear? Understand? Opposite it is. Clear? Okay. Mobile pulley. So that is what about the mobile pulley. So now let us have you all solved this question. Everybody understand? Yes. Please respond. Yes, sir. Yeah. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. One important thing I'll teach you about the mobile pulley. If you want to find the pulley, pulley movement or pulley acceleration. So acceleration of a pulley. So let me take acceleration of a pulley. Which pulley? Mobile pulley or fixed pulley? All of you. Mobile. Mobile pulley. Mobile pulley. How to find it means, let us observe. I want to find acceleration of a pulley. So this is very, very important. So let me consider now I'm having a pulley. This is what pulley actually? Mobile pulley. What pulley it is? All of you? Mobile pulley. Mobile. Having a two bodies. All of you observe very carefully. So having a two bodies, these are the two bodies. So I will say this body's acceleration is A1, upward direction. And this body's acceleration is A2, downward direction. Means from this I can understand who is having more mass. Yeah, this body or this body? This body. This body is M1, let me take. And this body is M2, you can take. So who is greater? M2 is greater than? M fastly. M2 is greater than? All of you? M1. Am I right yeah. or wrong? Others? Can you understand? Yes, sir. Then, yes, I'll yes. remember the acceleration of the mobile pulley, which is equals to acceleration of this is A1 plus A2 by 2. A1 plus A2 by 2. So, this is the formula two. for acceleration of mobile pulley. But the problem is here, you must consider with the sign convention. What do you have to consider, everybody? With the Sign convention. Clear? Right. For example, again same thing. If this is the surface going up, positive. Coming down, you should take it as a what? Everybody? Negative. Okay? Now the pulley is showing upward. So positive or negative? Up? Everybody? Positive A. Okay. Next. Positive. A1 going up. Positive or negative? Up? A1. Positive. positive. Understand the rest one? Positive. A1. Next. This one. Minus because A2 is going down, so that it will what will happen? Minus A2 minus. divided by A2. 2. Clear everybody? So AP, if it is going up, we'll get A1 minus A2 by 2. Hope you all understand. With the sign convention, with the sign you must take. Is it okay, guys? Please respond. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Suppose if the pulley is going downwards, acceleration is downwards, then AP is what? Negative or positive? AP is what? Negative or positive? Pulley acceleration. Downwards. Negative. 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 That is you should understand. Clear guys? Everybody? Can you able to find it? Everyone please respond. 
So what is the acceleration of a pulley, everybody? Mobile pulley, A1 plus A2 by 2. But you have to remember, with the sign, need to multiply. Clear, everybody? With the sign, you have to mention it in the formula. So if it is going above from the surface, you can take it as a positive. Towards the surface, like anything below the horizon, we will take it as a negative. Okay, Mr. Rohit, Mr. Rishi. Understand the rest, sir? Yes? That's yes, sir. So let us take now it's the same question. So there is a string which is like attached string. Okay. So rigid surface. So I am attaching this thing at this one end. So if it is attached to this one end and here there is a mobile pulley. There is a what pulley everybody? There is a mobile pulley. Mobile. There is another pulley. What is this pulley anybody? This is a pulley. Fixed. Yes, please. Fixed pulley. So let me take the mass is 2 kg and here the mass which is attached is 1 kg. Clear everyone? Okay. So now, all of you observe, now the acceleration of this body is downward direction. Means this pulley is going upwards or downwards? Everybody? All of you? Downward. Downwards. Sir. This body is coming downwards. So the pulley, mobile pulley is moving upward or downwards? The pulley upward. upward. Got upward direction. Clear everybody? So this is what pulley? Mobile pulley or fixed pulley? This is mobile pulley. Mobile. And this is what pulley? Fixed pulley. Clear fixed up pulley. others everyone. Now, so as we know, the string is attached here. All of you observe very carefully. The string is attached here. Attached string. The string is not moving. So if it is attached string means, what is the acceleration of the string? Anybody? What is the acceleration of the string? Yes, please. No motion. So that what is the what is the acceleration of the string? Everybody. Yes, Zero. please. Let I am taking. Let AP uh, mobile pulley acceleration is moving upward direction. Then here you can see this entirely same string. So that here acceleration A means downwards. The pulley is going upward. Then here what is the acceleration? Here also how much is the acceleration? Everybody. Acceleration will be same. Am I right or wrong? All of you. Yes. The same string is coming down. So if it is moving down with the acceleration A, then it is rising up also in how much acceleration? Everybody. Yes. Only one side, not two sides. This side, what is the acceleration, everyone? That is also will become respond raw. A. Clear, everybody? All of you? Please respond. Now. Sir, yes. two A only, no, sir. There, A. Is. That is what I am considering. This is attached string. This side it is attached, it is not moving. Then this acceleration is zero. Do you understand, Rigresha? Okay, sir. This side string is acceleration is zero. Clear. Only this string is moving. Only by moving this string only, it is body is lifting. Purema? Yes, sir. Yeah, that is what. Clear? That is what you should understand. So now I want. What is the pulley acceleration? So, what is the formula for pulley acceleration? Everybody? A1 plus A2 divided by A1 plus A2 divided by 2. So, only this move, this is the mobile pulley. Observe very carefully. This side A and this side A0. So, then what is the answer? Mobile pulley acceleration. All of you. You should speak, guys. What is the acceleration of mobile pulley? A1. This is A1 or this is A1, whatever you can take it. So A1 is A plus A2 A by is 2 divided by 2. So what is the mobile pulley acceleration, A everybody? A by 2. A A by two. Clear? Understand, Amma? All of you? That is what. So if, for example, the same question, if I consider that the entire mobile pulley is traveling with, the, for example, upward with A acceleration, then this body will travel with a downward with what acceleration? Fastly, everybody. The body will travel with what acceleration? Downwards. Just now we studied. If this is A, then here what is the acceleration of this body? All of you. 2A. 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 All of you. If entire mobile pulley is moving upward with a acceleration A, then this side, the fixed pulley body will go in a downward direction with what acceleration? Everybody? It will okay. go with the, yes, please respond with the 2A. 2A. Is that all of you? No. One important sum we'll solve now. This will in increase your confidence uh, more effectively. So let us see. So take it one surface. 
where at the end we have been attached one fixed pulley. There is another surface, okay? So there also there is a pulley which is attached to it. Clear everyone? And there is a rigid surface where this pulley is end, dead end. That is what attached. So the means in the sense of what is the acceleration in this string? All of you. Attached it is. What is the acceleration in this string? Everybody? Yes, please. Zero. Zero. Clear? Now. So there is a 3 kg object. All of you observe very carefully. There is a 3 kg object which has been attached to this. And there is a mobile pulley here. This is what everybody speak. What is this? Mobile? Mobile pulley. Understand the dress? Clearer? Understand? Yes, no. So you tell me, this body is what, what is the acceleration? This is the side of the acceleration. If the body will go downwards. Am I right or wrong? So here, the 1 kg object is attached. So now tell me, if the body goes downwards, the acceleration of the pulley, if you notice it, the mobile pulley is downward direction. What is the acceleration of the mobile pulley? Everybody? Yes, please. Downward, downward direction. Downward. Now I want tensions. Can you tell me what is, the, can you mention what is the tensions? Here, what is the tension of the string? Here, the tension of the string is same string. So the tension T. Here also tension what? Same T. string. So here also tension what? T. Now see, this pulley, this body is going like this direction, like this direction, so that here is the acceleration is A means. Here also what is the acceleration? Everybody. Here also what is the yeah. acceleration? A. Yeah. Understand, Ra? Please respond, Ra. Yes, sir. Yes, now. Yes, sir. You know this is attached one. That is what? Attached string. So that I consider here acceleration is zero. Then what about here? Here also what is the acceleration? In this entire zero. string? Zero. Zero. Clear, everybody? Please respond. All of you, mobile string. Okay. So only this body is coming closer so that this pulley is going down. Do you all understand what I'm saying exactly? Clear everyone? All of you? Yes. That is what. So now the acceleration of the pulley is downward direction. So can you find the what is the acceleration of pulley is equals to A1 plus A2 divided by 2. So now. What is the A1? AP. See that acceleration is also acting downwards. Acting downwards. And acceleration of pulley is also acting downwards. So it is negative or positive? Negative. Minus. Yeah. This A1 is also. This is A1 to the reserve. So A1 is acting downwards or upwards? A1 is A. A, A is equal to A. So this is also negative. Minus A plus 0 divided by 2. So now minus AP is equals to minus A by 2. Minus minus will get cancelled. So what is the acceleration of the pulley, everybody? A by 2. A by 2. Clear, everybody? Understand or not? Yes, sir. Yes. Now the same thing. Shall we write the equations and we shall we form it, everybody? Shall we write the equations and we'll solve, all of you? Yes, sir. Yes. So let us solve it. So observe very carefully. Now, as we know, here is the tension is T and here is the tension is T. Then what is the tension here? T or 2T? 2T. 2T. Clear? All of you understood or not? Please respond. Yes? yes sir. Now, imagine that as this body is moves some distance, this pulley will go downwards or upwards? That is what my question to you. Downwards or upwards? Downward. Downward direction. Clear everybody? So the pulley will move into, for example, this is the position of the pulley, new pulley. Okay, guys? Can you able to understand? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. That is what. So the new pulley moves. The pulley moves x ah. How many meters it moves downwards? All of you? How many meters it will move X. down? X meters. So we all know that if this is the mobile pulley, here is the tension T and here also tension T. And what about the tension here? All of you. Here the tension is? 2T. Clear? So 1 kg object is mentioned. So now, apply the equation. As we know, 1 kg, then gravitation is acting downward direction. That is what weight. Weight is equals to 1G. Now, take this body 1 kg and tell me what is the forces acting? Upward direction. It is acting, what is that? 2T and downwards it is acting G. So that, what is the equation will come? Fastly you should tell me. 2T, acceleration is downwards. So that G minus 2T or 2T minus G, everybody. Acceleration is downwards. So this is positive and this is what? All of you should speak. Negative. So, G minus 2T is equals to, that is what, F net. 
F net is equals to MA. So that what will happen? G minus 2T is equals to everybody. G minus 2T is equals to 1A. Am I right or wrong? Fastly respond wrong. This is equation number one. Then second body. Second body if you have taken. All of you observe very carefully. If this body will go with acceleration A downwards fully, then what about this acceleration of this body? This body. Because two parts it is going. Then what about this acceleration? Fastly. AR to AR. See, if this body moves x meter downward direction, so here this 3 kg body need to travel how many meters? x meters or 2x meters? Are? 2x meters. 2x meters. Because both meters. It has to be stretched. Yes or no, Mr. Dreswa? Clear? Okay? Yes, sir. Because this side no acceleration. That is why. So, if this body moves x meter downwards, then this 3 kg object moves how many meters? Everybody? 2x meters. Now, if I consider now the pulley acceleration, we got it AP is equals to, let me consider AP is equals to A. Then, sorry, the pulley acceleration is A. Then what about the acceleration of 3 kg body? Acceleration of 3 kg body, how much it will become? Not A, it will become. Pulley is moving with the A acceleration. Okay. Then what is this acceleration of this body? All of you, 2A. 2A. Yes or no, guys? Please respond. Yes? No. Yes, yes sir. Body force acting downwards, that is what 3G, of course, normal is acting upward because it is not going upward or downward, going horizontally. So that this both will get cancelled. Am I right or wrong, guys? All of you? Balance. Gone. So only one force is acting, that is what 2A. So then if I draw the free body diagram, make it quick now, free body diagram, only acceleration is acting. So that's all. So then what is the answer? Net force is equal to tension.